shit. It's Gay Kara, Leo, and Emmy. What is going on, y'all? Welcome. I'm going to hop right in. This is a... Let me make sure I'm totally not in frame. Tight. I'm a pro. What's going on, guys? Uh, Gay Kara, Leo, what are you doing this Thursday? Answer. You're watching at some point because I'm playing your level for Heroes of Might and Magic. That's what you're doing. Because... Uh, I ain't got nothing to do on Thanksgiving, just the way I like it. Saw me streaming a shitload of games, and your level is one of them. So I'll send you a uh, whisper. Arkanoid Addict, here he is. So here we go. Arkanoid Addict, as a, as a thank you, a personal thank you for actually unfollowing me and staying unfollowed. That's dedication, Arkanoid Addict. We're going to start with one of my favorite games of all time, Dragon's Lair, if it works. It's not working, which is hilarious to me. I'm like, we're going to play this game. And my computer's like, ha, ah, your controller's not going to work. I'm like, okay, please. Please. There we go. Is your mic a little low, or is it my computer? My mic is a little lower than usual. Um... Your computer might be a little low. L anybody let me know if I'm also super low. I fixed the mic settings a little bit, so I'm not as loud and obtrusive. But anyway, hello. Hi, Emmy. Just got done with work. Had dental surgery, which was so fun. Please tell me all about your dental surgery. That sounds awful. And you can tell me by typing. So you don't have to use your mouth hole. How many Ds do you have to go through? How many Ds per day? Chadley, it's going to be a lot of Ds per day. Oh, God, no, this doesn't look like the arcade game at all. This looks so awful. No, I want to just play the arcade game with the flashing lights. Oh, God damn it. Anyway, uh, Chadley, there's at least 70 Ds to make it through. I'm going to be doing a lot of Ds a day. It's going to be just like college. This mic is good to me. Almost max volume, and you're a little quiet, but I'm on mobile. Well, let me just move my mic a little here. Do you want to see my fight game character concepts? You already showed them to me, but uh, share it again, K. Carolia. Is it different than the one you showed me last time? Those things that you made? Did you update them in a different way? I would be happy when we get a couple more uh, people in here to show you the full ones. Show me, man. I want to see them. They're even in 3D now. Then absolutely I want to fucking see them. Let's go. Uh, I had a permanent crown put in today. I've been going through getting implants the last two years. Those temporaries, man, those will mess you up. I'm just saying, any dental surgery is terrible. I hate this so much. Oh, God. I don't. I don't like this. I don't. I don't. No, I just want to play the arcade version. Why would... Who would do this? What kind of human being? What is this? Why? Who would make something like this? Who would make this game? Why? Why? Why is this a game? Why? Oh God! All right, take care, Leo. I'm I'm pausing this because I got your thing. So I want to show these. I'm taking a look at them right now on my Discord. I just want to play Dragon's Quest. That's all. I just want to play Dragon's Quest. Here are the ones the full versions are ready. Dope. Dope. Oh, my God. I love the grandma. Jacked grandma. First 3D concept. Those are really cool, man. Those are really fucking dope. I'm like, that's really dope. Props to you, man. I'm going to share those a little later when we get a, a little a few more people in here. I took out my two front teeth and wear a denture. R.I.P. R.I.P. Chadley's front teeth. But your smile's still perfect, Chadley. Undefeated. My front tooth needed a crown. I feel your pain. I've had three pin implants put on my lower right side. And they're not talking about butt implants. hey oh, Yo, if y'all don't take the motherfucking plunge, I don't know what to tell you. Shout out that plunge, daddy. A guy showed up offering to make the OSTs for this game. This is going out of control. It's great, man. It's great. It's a good game. I don't... Okay. So this is not what I remember or wanted. Eh. 
Why? Why? Why does this exist? I don't. This is like. Okay. What? I don't. Uh... Oh, God. Yeah, no, I really like the cake here, Leo. Keep me updated because it's really cool. It's definitely very one of my favorite things. Plunge Daddy, I think I have to go. You're like, that's not what I came here for. Why? What is... What is this? I just want to play Dragon's Lair. I saw Dragon's Lair. I like, I like that arcade game. That's a fun arcade game. What is this? Uh, there is no sound on the game. You're not missing anything, but I'll, I guess I'll put some sound on. You're really not missing anything. Oh, God. I just want to play, I just want to play a game. That's all. I just want to play a game that I like, that is like a game that I remember. I have to make it past this first stream. Because I don't know what. All you need to hear is obsessive suffering. I'm so happy I'm here for you, Emmy. I really am. So here's my unlimited knives. I have five lives. Enemies. Uh, I don't know. Jump, but don't jump. Okay, there's the one hole in the bridge. This is like obsessive repulsing. I am. I'm repulsing all those around me and even myself. Okay, so I can't duck into the dragon. Can I kill the dragon with my little daggers? Turn around. Okay, or just fall. Just fall and die through the bridge. Up. Oh, nope, just falling and dying through the bridge. I just, I, I, you know what, guys? Is help allowed? Yes! Help me. Okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> Fell through a hole that's smaller than your feet. This is all Arcan Arkanoid's fault. I have so much respect for him because he beat Cobra Triangle, so now he's like, oh, I want to see this game. It's pretty good. Okay, get up here so I can... I don't know if I'll allow it. Yeah, uh, yeah. Plunge is an unofficial uh, moderator. Oh, he ducks when I'm... Okay. You need to go back to the left corner. Don't walk into the hole. All the way. So what you're saying, Arkanoid, is I have to go all the way. I know. I got to go forward, lure the dragon out, then hop back, and then throw the daggers at him. Ah! What the fuck? No! Why? I'm back in the left corner. All the way. How many holes are in this bridge? There's like three holes in the bridge. <laughs> Who made this bridge? Who would play this game? Like, who would play this game and be like, I want to keep playing this? Nobody. Zero people. No one would see this and just be like, you know what? <laughs> oh, shit. Chadley, that was good. Props to you. It's the perfect number of holes. Okay. Try calling after the hole. You know, I find myself crawling towards the hole all the time. Okay. Okay. Nice hole, hot plunge. Okay. I love the idea that dragon fire immediately sears you to a skeleton. Like, this ain't your mama's dragon fire. All the daggers. Now watch me fall into a hole and die. I'm just saying. That's funny. That's the spirit. Why 
Why are you throwing things at me? You're in pr A rock melts me. A, <laughs> fucking, a fucking rock from the prisoner. Yeah, first screen done. Screen one done. Screen one out of 720. Uh, some people go into holes. It feels good. You know, you're not wrong, Emmy. You're not wrong. Uh, uh, took 10 minutes to pass the water bridge. I don't even... I gotta crawl past the prisoners now, I presume. What does the G even mean? You only need 500 points to beat Dick. He's such a dick. He's always playing these games, and he's like, Oh, what's up, Obsessive? I see you're playing my favorite game. Ah. Oh, that was close. A rock wrecks you. It doesn't just, like, knock me out. It completely melts me into a puddle of goo. It's like what happens whenever Chadley hands me another bottle of wine outside the fire pit. Yep, there I go. This is so fucking ridiculous. I don't... You know, when I saw it on the list, because Dragon's Lair, the arcade game, the sequel is one of my favorite games. I love it so much. I think it's so campy and corny and fun. It's really one of my favorite games. I saw this on the list and I said, that's weird, I never played this for Nintendo. I wonder why. I don't wonder why anymore. This is an ins, I don't, okay, so did this come out first? That's what I need to know. Did this come out first? Because if this came out and they were like, well, this can't be. We've got to make a superior and timeless arcade game so that people forget the taste of this Nintendo game. I don't think that's what happened. I think Nintendo's like, everyone loves Dragon Player, Lair. Dragon Player. Dragon's Lair. Let's make a terrible non-version of it that's a platformer. And I'm melted into fire again. I can't. I can't. I can't. The space one is really cool. Oh, no, the bat got me. Okay. I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. Oh, thank God. Hey, Carolia. Wait, maybe this was the secret sauce I needed the whole time to that special unfollow. That sweet, sweet unfollow I've been looking for. Plunge, thank you to the contribution. What are we up to right now? If someone can tell me percentage-wise. Ah. I think we're so close. Gold bonus. I got a gold. Okay, well, you can't refollow after you unfollow, K. Carolio. What am I supposed to do? How to... I hope you were... I wasn't too mean in picking this. No, I think this is exactly the spirit of what people were hoping for with this kind of game. 95% complete of the community challenge. Emmy, thank you so much for the contribution as well. That's very sweet. Hey, Kara Leo, thank you for the contribution. We did it, yo! Did we do it? Did we make it? Are we building an Ecto on Thanksgiving? Is that what's about to happen? Because I see it got the 50K. Did we get there? Are we there? Not yet. It said 50K. Oh, we're so close. Oh, we're 300 squeakies away. You know what? You know what? You know what? Leave it at 99% forever. It's so much funnier that way. I'm going to try one more time. I'm going to try one more time. Just for fun. Because me dying at this over and over is not... It never ceases to be hilarious for me. Please, that's what I'm saying. That's funny. What if we're like, oh, it's at 99%, blah, 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 and then everyone just was like, you know what? I don't give a shit about this Lego build. Let it expire. All right, y'all, we're not doing the alphabeticals again, so if you have a D game that you want... Oh, come on. If you have a D game that you want to see me play for the Nintendo, uh, don't be shy, just write it in the chat. Or... If you'd like to see me just play this, the arcade version, because we all had this terrible taste in our mouth from watching this nonsense, I can't crawl over the hole. I can't crawl over the hole. Let me know either way. I'm open to either playing more D games 
or just playing this on name. Uh, because I really do love this game. Not this one. Not whatever this is. I don't know what this is. This is a punishment for past transgressions, I can only assume. He's got a sword. Use your sword. Oh, God. And I fell in the hole. I'm good. I'm good, y'all. Uh, this dude looks like he's gonna take it up the pooper when he gets on his knees. Can I just say, and I noticed this with Castlevania too, like when people die in Castlevania, they, they like sit ass up in the air, like slump. It's very much the, oh no, ready for butt stuff. Like it's the same thing. Is there one programmer at Nintendo working at the time who was secretly like, I just want all of the male protagonists to be ass up in the air to do that. Uh, so there you go. Thanks, Dragon Slayer. Thank you, Arkanoid Addict, for that suggestion. Um, that really, that really hurt my heart. Defender 2, not to be confused with Defender 1. The music already. Oh my god. It sounds like I'm playing, like, Adventures of Lolo. Oh my god, look at this shit show. Plunge, never change. I can't believe they made two of these. <laughs> oh god, this looks awful. What is, is this? Is this an Atari game? It looks like it. It it was an Atari game in 1981, and they were like, let's make it for Nintendo and change none of the graphics. It's the punch-out music. It's the punch-out music, you guys. It's the, oh, God, it's the, uh... The Glass Joe Universal, like, oh, well, it's not the Glass Joe music. It's the Universal intro music. That was the intro to this. They couldn't even make their own music. They had to use the punch out music. Did I just warp? What's going on? What is happening? Oh, they're kidnapping people. I just murdered a person. What is happening? Uh, I don't think it was a secret, but Nintendo, I feel, has always liked the butt stuff. <laughs> if anyone knows anything about butt stuff, it's Nintendo. Family friendly. That's just another disguise. Looks like shit, to be honest. I mean, yeah. This is pretty awful. I don't know what this is. Mike Tyson is going to be the boss. I hope so. Is that it? One more? Attack, wait, it's the Mike Tyson music! This is literally, that's the music when you lose in Punch-Out! They recycled Punch-Out music for Defender 2? Ah, I, I don't need, wait, I, I think I, I need to call somebody. This is, is, is there, can I call the police? What is happening? It's literally the punch out music. How about some dark man? Well, first of all, let me save all of these people because this looks like one of those games that I'm just curious if it's literally like the same two enemies for the whole game. Cause not gonna lie, that's what it looks like. Oh no! I've been destroyed by a superior foe. Lazy is right. All right. Uh, Dark Man it is. Oh, God. I remember Dark Man the movie. Dark Man the movie is really, really messed up. Especially the uh, spoiler alert for anyone who hasn't seen it. Where he, like, just makes the face and he goes to the party and the face starts melting off in the middle of the party. I'm like, I think I'm too young to be seeing this. And I was right. Oh, when all the people die. Okay. 
Okay, so only D games. Any D game. Any D game as long as it's not a Disney game or a Dungeons and Dragons game or a uh, Dragon, Double Dragon, Dragon Warrior. All those ones I'm saving for their own thing. But trust me, there's a lot of random D games out there. There's a whole lot of Nintendo, if you know what I'm saying. I don't know what this game is. I don't know if I want to know what this game is. I mean, I, I feel like I pretty much have an idea of everything this game has to offer. I don't mean that to be, like, pompous sounding, but I'm not wrong, right? Buzz is here. Have a safe drive. Ah, have a safe drive. We'll be playing some Darkman when you get back, because holy shit, this game is trash. Thanks, Defender 2. We hardly knew you. Dark man, ah. This might actually be a, a fun little platformer. We might play it for a little bit. Ah. Do you have the power pad? We could do dance aerobics. I do have dance aerobics. I don't have the dance pad. However, I'm trying to find out whether it's in my emulator or another one that I can find where I can input commands on my PlayStation controller, which I just use as my universal controller, uh, into pretending it's the dance pad. Hey, Carolio, it is not Rorschach, but some people say it is the inspiration for Rorschach. So I would use right foot, left foot, and then I would just go in the directions like this. But then I would also get up and dance around like I'm doing it while I'm holding the controller. But we're going to save that for its own ridiculous stream. I got to see if I can make it work. Bump, 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 bump. I like that hand. I feel like that's an emote that I can make. Yeah. It's, uh, it's pretty close. Well, here's the story. Dr. Peyton was a brilliant scientist who was working on a new synthetic skin, ideal for burn sufferers. Taking old photographs of burn victims, he was able to mold a mask using a computer to recreate their faces. Unfortunately, the skin was photosensitive and could not last over 99 minutes in light. That's a shame. An evil gang led by Durant broke into the lab looking for important documents. An important document. They killed Peyton's assistant and attempted to leave no witness. They blew up the lab, Peyton with it, but he survived. Horribly burned, he was given a new surgical technique which made him unable to feel any pain. And Darman is written like Watchmen. Yeah. Unfortunately, the treatment had side effects. He had violent mood swings and adrenaline flowed through his body, unchecked, giving him great strength. Peyton escaped from the hospital and became Dark Man. Help Dark Man control his rage and gain his revenge. Oh, well, okay. Oh, that's the story. I get it. I thought I'm like, is this the game? They're like, no, that's the story. Here's the game. The story so far. Dark Man is trapped inside a deserted warehouse by Durant's men. You must escape the complex and carry out your plan of revenge. Use buttons A and B to balance on tightrope. Funny. Okay. Punch, kick, punch, punch, kick. Dark man can't duck. Can I jump? Uh, uh. It's gonna be a short game, y'all. A single tear. I mean, I like what this game is trying to do. 
I just don't help. Like, what do I? Ursa, I love it when a doctor tries to heal me but accidentally gives me superpowers. Ursa Frank, welcome in, every. Welcome in, buddy. Haven't seen you in a hot minute. Plunge said you were feeling under the weather. It's good to see you again. Also, Ursa Frank... Ah, oh, there we go. I can climb up the walls. I'm like, how the fuck... my super strength for you. You know, Ursa Frank, sometimes I go to the dentist. Uh, that's why I was wondering with Emmy. She went to the dentist and uh, got her teeth fixed, but maybe she accidentally got superpowers and didn't realize it. Russian storm. They came in like a Russian storm. I don't, uh, I don't know what this game is. I just know it's awful. And not like awful, fun, awful. Russian Storm, there's a... Oh, God! He just punched me off the ledge, this dick. There's a high percentage chance I am going to be plating it later. I'm just throwing that out there. Yesterday, I had the privilege of playing plated with Russian Storm and the Lames. Yeah. And what a fun little game that was. What a fun little game that is. What am I supposed to jump on these fucking bubbles? <laughs> this game is so awful. There's like, here's the ledge. Jump off it, but also just fall. Yeah, that was fun. That was so dope. That game was really fun. Oh my god. Come on, dark man. Get your shit together. Jump. Like, all of my super flowers are completely irrelevant for bullshit platformers, which is what this is. This is a bullshit platformer. Emmy, why did you suggest this game? I think everyone suggests Nintendo games because they're like, no, go play it. This one's going to be fun, I promise. I'm like, I don't think it's going to be fun. They're like, no, you'll love it. I don't... Wednesday night we'll be streaming it again. Well, I know where I'll be Wednesday night watching you guys run your restaurant. I will say, Belames is a pretty good cook. Some of that cooking stuff that he was doing, preparing everything beforehand and whatever, I would not be thinking that far ahead. Okay, so there you go. Do I jump on this fucking little bubble? Is that what happens? I guess not. I guess that's not the answer to the question that I just asked. Ugh. Balance on the tightrope. This game is giving me so much rage. Unconditional rage. Okay. No! Stop it! Why? You go to the ledge and then you just fall off. I know. Dark Man. A single tear from Dark Man. Rage. Rage. We would need two other players. If you'd like to join in like last night, that'd be jolly good fun. I would absolutely like to join in. Uh, for those who were did not get to see the stream, I was the busboy extraordinaire. I cleaned up grease piles, and occasionally they let me run a piece of food out to a table. So I'm working my way up the ladder. No! No! God, he's kicking me off the ledge. I love that Darkman is, like, doing this very elaborate cape flourish. Like, dude, you're getting owned by everyone. You're falling off the ledge here. I don't think now's the time to be showing off your cape skills. God. King. Damn it. Darkman. I'm not this bad at video games. This is just, like, why would you... Okay. This game was programmed by Homer Simpson, his little woodpeckers on the top left. That's right. I don't understand what that even means. Is that the amount of time I have until... I don't know. I don't get it. That I don't fall off of. But if I walk too close to these blue ledges... There you go. All right, 
right, here we go. I'm jumping. I'm going to make the jump. I'm making it. Obsessive. This guy couldn't possibly be inspiration for Rorschach. Rorschach debuted in 1986, Darkman in 1990. Well, when I said the inspiration, what I meant was he's a copy of Rorschach. So the opposite. Four years wrong. That would be me. I'm four years wrong. What I meant to say was that they copied Rorschach. Yeah. What the fuck? What was that? Am I in a fucking Looney Tunes movie? What the hell was that? I jumped over and all of a sudden it's like, ha ha, random press out of nowhere just killed you so good. Like this is, is this one of those Bugs Bunny games I was playing before? Because that's what that, that felt like right there. What do those blue flasks even mean, by the way? And I just jumped to my death. The jumping is not consistent in this game. The punching is nothing. I don't feel any sympathy for Darkman. I'm like, you're the worst superhero ever. It's not even a fighting game. I thought it would just be a fighting game. Make it a double dragon beat em up platformer. No! Oh, I, I'm sorry. I can't touch the bubble. Oh no, you wouldn't want to touch the bubble. A big scary bubble will hurt you. I can't even. I can't even with this game. No, and he just kicked me off in one fell swoop. Hey, can I put on a mask of a different character who doesn't suck? Can I be anyone but myself? Is that a uh, option for this game? God. Damn it. I'm not this bad at video games, you guys. I mean, every game that I've played in my stream uh, indicates otherwise, but I used to be really good at video games. I just, you know, they need to not be janky pieces of shit. That's all I'm saying. God fucking damn it. Do you want to play a good D game? You could Dragon Spirit. At this point, I don't know. Honestly, I might just want to load up the emulator and play uh, Dragon's Lair, the arcade version. Or Captain America and the Avengers. Don't hit the bubble. Don't hit the bubble. Don't hit the press. Okay, what are you doing? Come on. Aha! Aha! Eat it! That's the end of the level? Great. Go! There's a platform there. I should have jumped on it. Yep. I have to tell it where to go. I have to get on the platform. I hate this so much. It's like it grabs you. It grabs you. It's just like ah! No, I didn't want to go that way. I didn't want to go that way. Did you ever try Dragon Spirit? I've never played it before. I've never heard of it. But I will be happy to try it. But now that I know this is unlimited continues. Now that I know it's unlimited continues, I'm kind of curious. Arkanoid Attic, what is Dragon Spirit about? I think I'm getting the learning curve of this game now. is this game is bullshit. There's nothing you can do to change the bullshit that is this game. This game is bullshit. That's the learning curve right there. That's the whole learning curve of this game. Yeah. What was that over there? I saw something. Oh, fire. Good thing I'm immune to fire, baby. Am I immune to fire? Should be immune to fire. My whole body's riddled in burns. Ah, God, I didn't see that. I didn't see that. 
Good thing I missed that. Okay, I'm starting to get good at this game. Maybe there's a learning curve. A shoot 'em up, but much better than defender shit. You mean defender too. Get it right. Staring at your only picture of Durant's henchman, Polly, you grab your camera. The more photos of Polly taken, the more time you will have to gain your revenge. Target Polly. What am I? Am I? Can I shoot them? Can I shoot them? Because right now they're shooting me a lot. shot a whole lot. I'm just saying. Is that it? I have four masks. I don't know what this is. I thought it was called Defender Shit. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> Maybe just from me saying it over and over again. What is this Defender Shit? I got a four mask. He tracked Pally down to Central Park. Putting on his mask, you look around. It feels like a trap, but you don't care. You know, I don't know about you guys. Uh, you know, those of you who live in the city or near New York City. If you don't, I just want to let you know... This is exactly what Central Park looks like. Exactly what Central Park looks like. There's fish jumping out of the lake. I don't know how to... Can Polly climb? I don't know. Yeah, he can. Look at him go. There's a, 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 a large lumber presence in Central Park. You know, there's a lot of people. There's lots of loggers in New York City. It's known for its logging. In fact, a lot of people say that uh, Central Park is the lumberjack capital of the world. So this is an accurate depiction of that. God fucking damn it. Never been over the sea. Well, then I hope, Arkanoid Addict, you can detect my dripping sarcasm because holy shit, is this nothing like Central Park. I don't know, I don't know what this is. I don't know what this game is, aside from a hate crime. Well, didn't make that jump. This just continues the impressive streak of terrible movie games, especially for the Nintendo. You just can't. What state are you in? I am a New York. I am in New York. So every time I go to Central Park, I love to see the bandsaws randomly. Oh, God. Flying over the logs. <laughs> this is just ridiculous. I don't even know. I don't even get it. I, I love that Darkman cries every time you get a game over. He cries a single tear, Ursa. Just one tear to let you know that he's not mad. He's just disappointed. Fuck, you live a state away from me. Oh, I'm so sorry. If you need to uh, talk to the lames and uh, upgrade your security, I understand. God damn it, will you hit him with this club? I thought you guys were... Fuck! I thought you guys were in Canada. Or maybe just near the border. Continue. Oh, 
boy, my attic continues. Even Darkman is like, you're done playing this game. Thank you, Darkman, for letting me finish. Oh, you live in Massachusetts. Why did I think you guys were Canadian? That's so weird. Maybe it's just Belame's disposition is that of a very relaxed Canadian. Oh, look at this bullshit. I'm so mad I didn't make it to the level where Darkman is hanging from the rope, catching coins on the highway. Well, certainly don't feel pressured to invite me to the wedding just because I live so close, even though you know that I will give a fucking ridiculous gift. Maybe that's who you're thinking about, Pablo. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know where that came from. You know, it's funny, like, ideas get into your head, and you're like, where the fuck did that come from? So, I don't know. Uh, all right, what am I doing now? I, I gotta play Dragon's Lair, man. I, I, I was so excited about it, and then that was so bad. If anyone in the chat still knows, there's a, uh... There's a, uh, there's the space version of Dragon's Lair. Does anyone remember what that is called? I would like to get that one as well. Just trying to find it. That, uh, we'll keep that music going. Uh, uh, what? Uh. Your wedding gift would be you in a box, right? I would never be so callous to consider myself or anything that I represent to be a gift. No, I'm very unoriginal. I just give shitloads of money. I don't, uh... It's like one of those little... I, I don't... When I got married, it was just like, everyone's like, oh, what's your registry? And I'm like, it's called cash. Oh, uh, well, no, we want to give you something that you'll remember for the rest of your life that you can use. Yeah, it's called cash. I'll use cash for the rest of my life. And I will remember what you give me because that's how my stupid brain works. So, uh, you know, thanks for coming. What the fuck is... I'm just looking for this game and it's not here. Uh, I'm so upset. Because I just want to play Dragon's Quest. Or Dragon's Lair. And I don't see it. Dragon's Lair. I got Double Dragon, I know that. I already beat those trouble dragons. This is great Twitch content, by the way. Me just looking for this one game that I can't fucking find. Ba -ba -ba. At least we have the Dark Man music to keep us company. Dragon Unit. That doesn't sound like a great game. Dragon's Lair, Time Warp. Yep. So it's only the second one. There was never the original for the arcade. That can't be. That can't be possible, right? I mean, I'm not complaining. Dragon's Lair 2 is a dope game. If anyone can remember what the first one is called, or um, or what the space version is called, please let me know in the chat. Unless somebody's already done it and I just haven't seen it yet because I'm a dunderface, then I apologize. Nice to see you both here, Ursa and Russian Storm. Zensman Space Ace is the game. Thank you so much, Ursa Frank. I'm going to get that real quick. Well, let me... Good evening to everyone. I don't know what you're talking about, but I don't remember the name. Space Ace. Space Ace. Ursa is like the gaming everything. All right, so let me copy this in here. Now, let me know if the main volume is like, go fuck yourself too loud, so I can turn it down. I don't want to hurt anyone's ears. I'm still getting used to this thing. Doot, 
62. So close to reaching the goal for the Lego build. Zensman, we are now uh, explicitly not donating to it. We want to keep it at 99% as an inside joke. And uh, I think we can do it. All right, let's bring this over here. Let's, uh, uh, let's make sure the volume doesn't isn't terrible. Nothing works. Nothing ever works. Why would anything work? I hate this all. Good thing you said that. I was just about to. See, we're trying to keep you. Oh, God damn you, Marissa Frank. You've done it, you magnificent bastard. And, of course, this version of Dragon Slayer doesn't work, because why would anything work and bring us happiness in our otherwise miserable lives? God fucking damn it. All right, give me another, uh, I guess, give me another Nintendo game to play, because this didn't work. Oh, here we go. Here's the original Dragon Slayer. All right. Let me try this then. Maybe two is broken and I'll find a working version of two. It's all such a big hassle. I just want to I just want to play a game with my friends on the internet and I just want every Thing to work, and I don't know why it doesn't work, you guys. Sniff, sniff. Sniff, sniff, sob, sob. All right, here we go. Let's make sure it works. Uh, how about Dragon Spear before I go to bed? Still at 99%. At 99% forever. Well, if this one doesn't work, then uh, this one doesn't work either. That's great. I don't even know what I'm looking at right now. How many of these things are open? My God. Dragon's Lair. Just play the game. Just make the game work. Computer. Nothing works. Nothing works anymore. You know what? That's fine. Dragon Spirit it is. Nothing wants to work today. It's fine. You know what? Dragon Spirit, and then I'm going to cook. I'm going to be a cook, damn it. Uh, let's see. Dragon Spirit. Dragon, 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 dragon. Dragon Power. Dragon Fighter. Dragon Spirit. The new legend. Don't be fooled by that old legend bullshit. This is the new legend. Dragon Spirit. Dope music, I like it. Time went by. I like to cook in real life. Um, yes and no, but I, I don't enjoy cooking from like the here's a meal and I make it with love kind of thing. I used to work in a restaurant, so I very much like the like A to B thing, which is why I like cooking simulators because there's no room for any ambiguity. It's like this goes to here, then this goes to here, then this goes to here, then this goes on the table. So when I saw you guys playing that game, I was like, oh, no. This looks like it could be my favorite game of all time. Because it just it uh, satisfied a whole lot of my stuff. It's over 30 years old. How come it's new? <laughs> Dragon Spirit, the new legend. Because if I haven't played it, it's new to me. Here we go. I'm a dragon, so that's dope. The hero Amru disguised as a blue dragon. Why would I need to disguise as a blue dragon if I could just be a blue dragon? It's finally about to fight the monster's wall. Nope. Ow. Ow. I don't know what's happening. 
happening here, but it's pretty dope. I see Dragon Spirit. Chi, 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 chi. Chi, this is a uh, Arkanoid Addict suggestion. Uh, oh, God. He looks pretty strong. I might be in some serious trouble here. Here we go. You guys, I think I'm about to beat the game. I think this is the final boss. Let's go! Yep. First boss, last boss. Good game. Good game, y'all. Welcome in, Chi. How are you? Oh. And had twins. Hammer came ill from his battle with Zual. Oh, that was just like the preface. It was like, hey, you're awesome. Anybody can beat this level. The twins were named Lace and Iris. Lace? Just saying. When you name one of your kids Lace, you're basically like, you're going to be a stripper, right? I mean, we're all cool with that? Okay, cool. I got the sword. Lace, yeah. Why not just l name it Cinnamon? Must be the first prequel I've seen in a shrimp. In a sh shmump, shmoop, shmoop. Bodacious booty. Yeah. Mommy, why did you name me Bodacious? Because we know that ass don't quit, honey. Now shake it for your dinner. My child's name, Bodacious or Booty? Shoot them up. All them up. Shoot all of the dragons. Obsessive doesn't know what Shrump is. Obsessive doesn't know anything. Oh, how many games start with dragon? Well, you've got uh, start with dragon or have dragon in them because there's double dragon, which doesn't start with dragon but has dragon in it. There's dragon, all the dragon warrior games. Um, Dragon Spirit, Dragon Fighter, uh, we can go to the list, let's see, mm -hmm. nope, that's not it, we read this out the other day, but I'm not a po, here we go, so let's see, na, na, na. of the D games that have Dragon in or on the title, uh, Double Dragon, Double Dragon 2, Double Dragon 3, Dragon Fighter, Dragon Power, Dragon Spirit, Dragon Warrior, Dragon's Lair. That's a lot of dragons. It's almost like Nintendo was like, you know what? People really like dragons. Let's, uh, let's put dragon in the title. Is it short for shoot 'em up? I was only joking. I don't have children and never will have. Well, not with that attitude, Arkanoid Addict, but if you keep beating all those games, eventually you're going to find a little someone who uh, wants to procreate with your gaming ability. Thanks, I was afraid I had to make it up for a second. Trump is short, is shorthand for shoot 'em up Shmup? I have literally never heard that before. This is the face of someone who is completely ignorant to any and all things that could be considered cool. Is indeed short for shoot 'em up Woot! Deduction skills on point. Somebody get, you know what? This is a perfect occasion for it. Ready? 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 Wait, where is it? Where is it? Snaps for Chi. Snaps for Chi. Oh, God. Anyone with access to the emotes, please do not be shy about giving snaps to people as I feel oh god as I feel like it is something that empowers us as a community to do ridiculous things to make each other feel better. Oh, and I'm dead. And I'm dead. Am I back at the fucking beginning of the Paleozoic era? All the way why did I need the sword? Why did I need the sword? I'm a dragon shooting fire out of my mouth. And like, he grabbed the father's sword in order to defeat, like, I'm not on a sword, I'm a dragon. 
I'm a dragon, bro. Shoot fire and take a name. Ain't no sword that's gonna be better than fire breath, know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Take that, Fudgy the Whale. I like that I have land and air fire. That's pretty cute. Ow. Now I can't kill him. Okay. Give me that power up, though. Give it. Give it. I'm a super dragon. Oh, yeah. I got two heads, y'all. Bring it. Bring it. I'm a super dragon, yo. Oh, I got hit. I am no longer a super dragon. Oh, God. I'm getting messed up. Oh, these flying dragons just coming out of nowhere and messing me up. Oh, God. Oh god! Serpentine! Serpentine! Ooh, woo, woo. Ooh, woo, 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 woo. Give me that X. Oh, I got mini dragons! I made dragon babies! And now me and my dragon babies are gonna fly and destroy all the baddies. Take that bad guys, I was armed with dragon babies. You sound like you're on the Beatles. Baby dragon, just what we need in this game. More dragons. I feel like this game is a little short of dragons for something that's named Dragon Spirit. I'm just saying. What is happening? So much stuff ha- I don't- like, I- I get that there's stuff happening, I- I guess I just don't understand all of the stuff that is happening. Here we go. Uh, ah. Leave me alone, you birds! You kamikaze birds! Foxana do. Chadley. I like the way you think, buddy. Foxana Do. Foxana Do is the shit, man. That that was one of those games. I played it randomly because I looked at the box and I was like, this game looks dope. And it was. And it's just so weird. Like it's the elves and the dwarves, but the dwarves look fucked up. Let me just uh die slightly here. Oh god. Let me just die slightly here. Chadleywick has contributed 76. We've done it, y'all. We're making Ecto-2. Maybe on Thanksgiving. I'm not doing anything Thanksgiving. That is fucking great. That game at the local retro store here is at a fucked up price of $250. First of all, that's a stupid price. Second of all, it is a good game, but not for $250. That's all I'm saying. Like, that's not a... Okay, and I'm burned. That is not a $250 game. Not even in a box, just a cartridge. Defeated by the dark power. Died in area one. Just the cartridge. No instruction book, no nothing. I should have kept the game. Little did I know. By the way, snaps for everybody. We got to 100%. So there's some snaps for everybody. Here's some nice little thumbs up. I really appreciate it. That was so cool. We did it. That's awesome. Um, so now we're going to play this game. Fox Anadu is literally one of my favorite games. I can't, I'm not even joking about it. Like, I played it obsessively, no pun intended, as a child. Uh, da, 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 da. Is it not in my list? How fucked up is that? What kind of list exists that doesn't have Fox Anadu in it? Oh, maybe because I'm spelling it wrong. That's fine. Get that fucking music in your soul, baby. Yup. Lego hype. That's a bit extreme for any game, let alone a fucking Nintendo game, but that's alright. I 
think it'll be, I think we'll do some facts on a do. And then we'll uh, do some cooking. That's really awesome. I can't believe we made the Lego thing. That's so cool. I put, uh, I put 50, like 50,000 up there because that's what, uh, that's what Plunge said. And I was like, that's never going to hit. Little did I know. Uh, Lego hype. Let me just catch up on chat. Oh, yeah. This ain't no D game. Hey, man, somebody cash in the points for the request. It would have been so much funnier if it was 69 points to get to the uh, thing, but that's all right. It's 20 bucks on eBay. Yeah, get it on eBay. What are you, what are you going to the store for? Hudson did make this. Hudson made a lot of good stuff. I'm home. How was Darkman? It was awful. It was terrible. It was so bad. And we got the Ecto one thanks to Chadley. Chadley Wick. Ba 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 ba. It's Chadley Wick, and it's got a. You know, you know the rest. I love how you just walk in. You're like, well, this town looks pretty fucked up. What's going on here? I've been on a long journey. I came back to my hometown to find it almost deserted. The gate is closed, people are gone, and the walls are crumbling. I wonder what happened. By the way, I went on a long journey. Okay. I went on a long journey. No clothes. No clothes. No gold. No nothing. I'm like, yeah, fuck it. I'm just going to go for a walk. Uh, ooh, dang, a cutscene? Yeah, you know how they do it. Well, I never played this. Don't want to spoil it for me. It's good. I think, uh, Arkanoid, I think... Based on the kind of games you play, I think you'll really like it. I want you to see the king right away, although you've just arrived. Yeah, well, you know, we all want things. What the fuck? Long wick, short fuse. hey -o! Uh, what I, I prefer to say instead of that is that you don't waste time on the uh, performance. You go right to the finale. He's clearly got robbed moments before he arrived. And they're like, go to the king. This is the elf town of Elios. Eolus. It is located at the bottom of the world tree, and the elves live here. Go to see a guru before you see the king. All right, well, someone wants me to see the king. Someone wants me to see the guru. Like, make up your mind, you guys. So going to bed now. Catch you later. Arkanoid, thanks for coming in. Thanks for the suggestion. Glad I could play that game for you. And uh, I will catch you on the flip side, my friend. First thing you always do is die to get more health. <laughs> Not this guy. Not this guy. I'm going to eat my food, damn it. You're going to see the king take the ring. This ring will identify you. Don't lose it. Ring of the elf. Yeah, because the king will be like, who's this guy? I've only lived here my whole life on a long journey. Look at this dude. The dwarves are already in town. It looks like the end is near. Yep. Oh, God. Yeah, those dwarves look pretty fucked up.
I shall give magic for 200 gold. Thank you. Watch your remaining power level. There's my magic. Alright, alright. Watch your attitude. Watch my remaining power level. Your face is a power level. What is this guy have to say? Do you have a weapon for fighting? No, man. Look at me. Do I look like I have a weapon for fighting? I gotta talk to Hans over here. Hello! I sell tools. What would you like? I come here to buy. What would you like? Uh, a hand. Ooh, I want the... Oh, I can't get both. God damn it. One short. That's funny. Thank you for shopping. There we go. Give me that hand dagger, though. Oh, it looks so cool. I'm so intimidating, you guys. I like how the key guy has a cigarette in his mouth. He's just like... <sighs> Making keys is really rough, man. You want... Oh, you want a what key? A jack key? Oh, I don't know, man. Keys are really tough. What would you like? Give me that J key. Thank you for shopping. Hey. You're welcome. I should have bought the magic first, but that's all right. I'm gonna use all my money. What era is meant is this meant to take place in? I don't I'm gonna say medieval. Um It's got a medieval kind of vibe to it. Uh he looks like Bill Murray has had a rough couple days. I just love that like this is the era where you could put a person actively smoking into a children's video game and they're like, Yeah, it's fine, he's a key maker, it's okay. Hey, uh, your majesty? I'm sorry, I may or may not have spent all the money. Can I have more, please? Disaster has befallen us. The air is mountain water. Yeah, yada, yada, yada. Make with the dough, Grandpa. Oh, that's never happened before. The guard outside is like, the king has dementia. Uh, just don't keep talking to him and getting money over and over again. That'd be a fucked up thing to do. And I'll be like, yeah, of course, I would never exploit his majesty in that way. Oh, hero, you've returned. Cough up the dough, old man. Let's fucking go. There's spiky guys in the street. <laughs> nice fox, hot Anna, too. <laughs> I call I called this game Fax like Fox Anadu forever and then I heard someone pronounce it correctly and I'm like, oh yeah, my whole life has been a lie. That's awesome. What would I like? I need some deluge. A deluge. And I will take uh, I come here to buy. got to deal with you dang kids coming in here for keys every day. You know kids aren't. Nobody's coming to buy a key. That's the, that's why he's so pissed off. He's like, oh, let me guess. You want a fucking key? Yeah, I want a key. You don't want no key. Get out of here. No, no, come on, man. You want a key, right? Ah, you want some fish? Dried meat to bring energy for 50 gold? Yeah, sure. I like his face. I don't trust this guy. He's got that weird, like, You want the fishes? I have good fishes for you. Like, it's pretty terrifying. Thank you for shopping. I think the other thing is, once you leave this village, you literally can never come back in. Hey. Ding. Yeah, you are the fish guy. I am the fish guy. There's a mark of a jack by the door. Welcome in, Hammy. It's a Hammy world. I've used key. Not the key. Just key. This is a Hammy world. But 
it would be nothing, nothing without some bread for him to eat. Ding, ding. You can't ever come back because you bankrupted the king. Yes, I saved the town and also killed everybody in it by taking all the kingdom's money. They're like, Your Majesty, what do you mean you gave all of our money to that guy? He wasn't even from here. Ding. Kill for everyone. <laughs> ah! Jesus. This it very much reminds me of, like, the Mega Man ladder mechanic. Crazy how this game has never saw a re-release. It's one of those games that I feel like has... Like, I get what you're saying. I think this game is really, really well done for what it is, but it's slip. It's one of those games that if you don't know it, you don't know it. Like, see, I've said to people, oh, I play this game. They're like, I've never heard of that game. Before. What the fuck is Fax Santa do? Maybe because I was saying it wrong. This guy sells a shield? I mean, it's no Chrono Trigger. We're not here grading on a Chrono Trigger scale. Yeah, this game, nobody's ever heard of it. This guy's got the super expensive shield, I think. And a death spell. Which is like, oh, do you want to sit here grinding people, grinding things in the beginning of the game like I did as a kid? Where I, okay, stop it. Stop it. I think this was the screen. No, it was the previous screen. Where I would just grind, grind, grind all day, and it was pretty awful. Uh, also, Raid has some Composer's Bomberman series. It has that same vibe to it. There's like Xanadu next or whatever. Oh baby, a death spell. I don't think I've ever bought the death spell because it's much cheaper later in the game. You sell tools. Do you sell a super overpriced magic shield that nobody's going to want to use? No, just all shit that I have. Although I will take a small shield because it looks cool. Thank you for shopping. You're welcome. I like how you walk differently with the shield. Like, without the shield... Oh, I can't take the shield off? That's funny. I think I can take the shield off. I can't take the shield off. I'll call the Brute Squad. You are the Brute Squad. I'm on the Brute Squad. If you grind F tier, you can get the great stuff. Yeah, I grind there all the time when I was a kid. I would be like, boop, back and forth, boop, back and forth, boop, back and forth. Um, yeah, it just doesn't make any sense. I've only heard about the name, never knew what kind of game it was. It's fun. If you have the mat talk, you can break the wall. But if you don't have it, you can't break the wall. A uh, mat talk should be in the tower. You can get it by defeating a dwarf. Good. And by defeating, he means killing. Kill the dwarf. There, there's the town of Four Paw ahead of you. Not to be confused with the town of Three Paw. Hey -o! You need peace of mind. I will meditate with you. Da -da -da -da. Meditate in this game is the, the code, which is very cute. I half expected the doctor to have a cigarette and watch out for the jar of poison. The poison will take your energy away. Hmm, wait, tell me more about this poison. I never remembered how cute this nerve sprite, nurse sprite was. Hmm. I've got some poison that you can uh, expel from me, nurse. I still have the old copy my parents had before I remember. They thought it was a bad game too hard or difficult. Hello, nurse, indeed. It is a hard game, but I like it. It's pretty good. Do you want a treatment? It's 250 gold, please. Yeah. Go ahead. Give me that treatment. Uh, don't try too hard. With the nurse, you mean? Because I'm going to try pretty hard. I'm just saying. What do these idiots have to say? You can carry eight items. They are all important. Choose well. Did you learn the Guru's mantra? The mantra will return you to this world. Hold on to the mantra. Yep, yep, yep. I get it. I mean, I can probably just put in a code, too. I can look up a code in three seconds and get the one where it's like, oh, here's the code for infinite money. But I'm not like that, yo. What an 
odd number of coins that that gives you. Uh, I think it's just a newer game in the series, but I don't know, I haven't played it. I've never played it either. Is it a Nintendo game, Chadley? I've used the key. killing the goat, that's a hundred per thing. So I kill the goat 77 times and I'll be all set. See, it's all coming back to me, y'all. When I said all coming back to me, I meant kind of coming back. I should have just used the magic. But a grandfather of all Japanese role-playing games called Dragon Slayer. Don't have negative thoughts. Remember your mantra. I wonder if that was the inspiration for um, Undertale. Determination. Don't have negative thoughts. I feel that felt very Undertale with that game over screen to me. You know what I mean? That was insane. Yeah, soon that's not even going to be like a big boss. That's just going to be like, oh, this is the boss you see out in the world just hanging around. But I do like the boss music. Did I lose my key? God damn it, game. You think I'm made of keys? Because I'm not made of keys, game. I got a, I got a limited number of keys. into the house, Chadley, and you'll be like, I've used keys! And your wife's gonna be like, the fuck are you saying? What is... keys? You're like, no, it's a game, baby, on, on Switch. Obsessive was playing it. She's like, I know the game. Why are you screaming it? And you'll be like, I don't have an answer. 
answer to that question right now? Alright, here we go. You gotta fireball him into the corner. Ding! No! Not again! Not again! This fucking dragon. I, now I gotta buy new keys, and I don't have any money to buy new keys, because my experience keeps going down to zero, because the dragon keeps killing me! Sorry for yelling. Because deep in hell, I've used key! Is divorced now. <laughs> Secretly, Chadley wants the divorce as much as Obsessive wants unfollows. Be like, you know what? Alright, okay, I gotta get a key. Now I gotta kill these guys. Now I gotta grind to get a key to go kill this dragon. Or try to. Who even knows? So for those not in the know, if you see the E on top of the screen here, that's my experience level. The higher my experience level, the more gold I come back with when I inevitably die over and over and over and over again. So now that my experience level is zero, I come back with zero gold. I came here to buy some fucking keys. Oh, good. Oh, they're so expensive. Thank you for shopping. You're welcome. Oh, my God. No, not the red potion. Although, that would have been a great thing to use while fighting the dragon that was murdering me. You know, I did get a potion that refills my health. Was I going to use it? Nah. Why would I use a potion that refills my health against the boss that keeps killing me? That seems like a strategy born to backfire. Sadly, I don't know if you've ever watched anybody speedrun this game, but it's kind of a surreal experience. You know, we're used to having it be this very long grind. I've used key! And that is not it. They come, they are... No potion run, let's go. That's right. That's what I meant to do. It's a no potion, no, no death run starting now. Before, the death was just to show you... I wanted to show you guys what it looked like when I get melted by a dragon's fireball, just so you can see. You know, but now... Now, no death. Eat it, goat. Speedrunners always blow my mind, especially when they use glitches and shit. I do admire, like, little glitches. I, I want things that are just like, these are cute little quirks in the game. For example, there's a quirk in Dragon Warrior where you can only open a certain number of chests at a time, or else the game doesn't understand it. So Arcus uses that cheat to do an unlimited chest spawn, where he just keeps opening a chest with money in it over and over again, and eventually gets a shit ton of money that way. And I was like, that's cute. That's not like I phase through a wall and skip three quarters of the game. Kind of thing. Although that is interesting too for Mario 64. Uh, oh, some of them are like, what the fuck, how do you even do that? And their memories have to be insane. Well, just, I, I appreciate the dedication of, like, especially for the longer speed runs. You, you make one mistake, and then you're like, yep, well, I'm going to reset again, and then I'm going to try this seven-hour speed run all over again. You're like, what? Why would, who does this to themselves? By the way, this is how you beat this boss if you're not an idiot like me trying to do it too fast. And the boss, I'm holding my talk, and the boss keeps respawning, so you can just grind him for money if you're good. If you spin around this tile exactly 75 times, you skip the boss. Speedrunners would grind that boss for money. Because if you catch him in a corner with your knife, you just hit him over and over again, and then that's it. Like easy money, baby. Oh, that's right. I can get these guys from here. I keep forgetting.
using that. This is also an easy help grind before the boss, too. I think that's meat, although when I was a kid, I thought it was bread. I'm like, oh, these spiky guys drop bread, because that makes sense. and these little dwarves in this kill room are going to have fun killing me for it. See? It's only half my health already gone. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I think those mushroom guys give health, if I remember correctly. Oh, these little flying fuckers. I'm going to die. I'm going to die, and Chadley Wick is going to There's that meat. Give me that meat. Now make your way to Cloud City to see Lando, I guess. I mean, isn't that how this game goes? How am I supposed to make that fucking jump? What? Die, mushroom. Yeah, give me that yummy food. That's a glove that does something? I don't remember. These guys are rough. Whoa. Nope. They do give a lot of money, though. But they are powerful. Get out of my way! I gotta go to the church! <laughs> How am I supposed to make that trump? First try. First try! Now I think they'll give me a new title. I shall give you a title. Aspirin. Make sure you live up to it. All right, no pressure. Jesus. Aspirant. You're an aspirant. Let me spend all my money before I die. Da, da, da. Look at all this stuff he's got. All this armor, these shields, these weapons. I'm like, wow, you got a lot of great stuff here. Can I buy some of this? And he's like, yeah, of course. What would you like to buy? The nothing that I have? Uh, I mean, yeah, I thought you would have more, but okay. I guess I'll take nothing. I will take the long sword, though. Aspirant. Must be Italian. Oh, I can't equip anything in his door. You don't want to hurt his feelings. Da, 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 da. By the way, how far did you end up in Chrysalis? Can't remember if I saw the whole stream. I got to the water sword, the third sword, and the first upgrade on it. So I got pretty far. Um, but it was just too late and I had early work. I, I would have totally bonked... No, I don't want to buy. I want to sell. I would have bonked the game, but I had to uh, I had to wake up early for work. I was kind of disappointed, but I started it too late. I didn't think... I have nothing to buy. You you don't want to buy my knife? Not ass sprint. <laughs> sprint with the ass! That 
stream is a blur of fire on my tongue. For those who missed it, we experimented. Plunge and I did some major Twitch experimentation. So, um, Plunge and I experimented with the guest star feature because Plunge said he still had those fire chips. Spend the 800 before you die. <laughs> There's nothing to spend it on. I need the armor. I guess I could go to the doctor. Um, I'll go to the doctor. Fine. Now. Ha! Ah, still alive. Um. And uh, plunge. Plunge ate the chip on stream. We got Guest Star working, and then he hung around for a little bit while we played Chrysalis. 500 gold! How, what are you doing, nurse? There is a spring in the Tower of Fortress. You'll find the dried-up fountain and the entrance to the tower right above this town. So long! I'll see you later. Sliver of health left. Yeah, just how I planned it. That's one pixel of health. That's it. You know what that is? That's enough health to buy a thousand dollars worth of keys. What would you like? I'll take, uh, uh, one of each, I guess. Give me that J key. <laughs> Alright, I also need to save up a bunch of money for those stupid wing boots. Um, Alright, let's die. I don't think there's... Well, why die when we can spend our money on fish? Tried me to bring energy for 150? Yeah, it's cheaper than the 500 gold the doctor's asking for. What a ripoff. At least I'll give myself a fighting chance here. I forget, what is the glove for? It's been so long. Now well, let's find out together. This was a grind. This, I remember this specific sequence of me walking out of town, hitting him, coming right back. But um bum but um bum but um bum like a rhythm over and over and over again. It's awful. This game brought out the worst grinding tendencies in me. Uh, thanks for showing the jury to get acquittal. <laughs> thanks for showing the jury. If the glove does not fit, then you must acquit. If the fox does not anadu, then you must bamadu. Now, how do I make that jump? That's the real question. Save up enough money to get those fancy flying boots. The power of the glove is gone. What? It's a temporary item? That's some bullshit. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. That's some bullshit. I can't believe the glove is a temporary as fuck. Like, that's terrible. shield. Alright, so this is where, with no reason whatsoever, maybe some guy tells you and I forget, this is where you fly up to get a hidden fountain. Okay. I'm trying to kill these guys so I can, I just want to grind some dough.
You guys, I'm holding red potion. I'm just letting you know. Ah! Uh, da, da. Oh god, okay. Stop holding the red potion and use it. I've used red potion. Da, da, da. The high jumper. sell tool. Oh, I don't have enough for it. Well, there you go. You said you sell tools, sir, and yet I don't see you for sale. Ha! 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 Because you're a tool. Get over here. Give me your meat. absorbs some of it. Just enough to be like, no, no, fuck you. But also here. Yeah, well, oh, we're a shield. Yeah, you're good. Alright, let me grind up and see if I can get enough for the boots. Without dying. Come on, buddy. Fly! Fly, fat ass! Fly! so terrible at jumping. It's just something that everyone does. You should just jump. That's easy. What a great way to grind some stuff. Hey man, I'm trying to learn how to fly. <laughs> Why jump when you can fly? You know what they say, flying... What? Flipping much? Flying is just uh, forgetting to... Uh, falling and forgetting how... Flying is just falling and forgetting to land. So just fall a bunch of... Why, why walk when you can ride? Why has one when two's better? Is, is. I'm here to buy. Give me the flying boots or studded mail. Eh, give me the stud. I need some armor. I should probably check in with the church, too. Because they'll probably give me a new title. Not that I don't mind being an aspirant. Oh yeah, I can't put on the armor in church. I shall give you a new title. Battler. Make sure you live up to it. Battler. I never played Morrowind. Again, my... I am so unexposed to a lot of stuff. I'm really quite the noob. I like that I'm wearing this armor, but I'm also... This is the ointment of invulnerability. I'm free from injury because of the ointment. But not for long. The sheer number of things... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Good thing I've got the ointment of don't know how to jump. the armor only covers my upper half. 
It's just sort of like, look, man, this is a party right here. I thought the ointment kept me safe from injury. I just got hit. Just saying. The power of the ointment is gone. Yeah, no shit. Some ointment. gonna go wrong here. I've used the key. Oh god. Enters, dies immediately. Goat's got some leg moves. Nice goat, hot leg. to get here. This is the spring of trunk. You need elixir to revive the spring. Will you give me your medicine? Come back with the medicine. Oh god. I forgot you need the elixir. Oh, there's some elixir. Ah! Nothing is gonna go wrong here. I've got the ointment. Just poison. I need 
need a food grinding spot, not a goat grinding spot. It's great having all this money, but if I'm dead, I can't spend it. I think that's poison, by the way, so I'm not going to touch it. Oh, God. There's the elixir. Died. That's the problem. <laughs> don't have negative thoughts. Remember your mantra, and don't worry, you've got 800 gold left. By the way, did you not find Dragon's Lair earlier? I did find it. Um, the copies that I was using on Name were missing files. It's always it's always a weird thing with Name. You never know if you like have the right thing or not. It's kind of frustrating. So I I it's one of it's going to be one of those things I have to workshop at another time. Like, I have Captain America and the Avengers working. So, I'll play that at some point. Oh, I can't have the elixir. I have to go find the elixir in the cave. Go fuck yourself, game. And I also need another jack key, because I believe I used my jack key. I just spent too much time jacking my keys. Better get another one, just in case. Give me that jack key, yo. I'm gonna be jacking it all over that cavern. The key. The key. Da -da -da -da. Jack in that key all over the cavern. Jack in the key all over the cavern. What did you think I was talking about? You guys have sick minds. It's not what you think. I use key. Good thing we learned not to get killed right at the beginning. So not the NES version of the game, but the original arcade game. Exactly. The NES version of the game was awful. Awful. I made it through exactly one screen of it, and it was the worst thing I've ever seen in my life. And I've played a lot of really bad games. It was so profoundly disappointing that uh, it might make a list. Let's put it that way. Sullivan Bluth presents Dragon's Lair? Really? Well, Sullivan probably shouldn't have his name attached to that project moving forward. I'm just going to make a little suggestion for Sullivan's career that maybe don't. Maybe don't be called Dragon's Lair. Ow. No, I need your meat. Stay up here. Hey, what's up? I don't remember coming this way. Come on over here. Oh, come on. I was hitting him in the head. Game. Don't have negative thoughts. Remember your mantra. I'm not having negative thoughts. It's just this game is stupid and you're stupid and everyone's stupid and I need to buy another jack key. Yeah, now he's, he doesn't even get the boss music anymore. Now he's just a regular dude. And they're like, have fun trying to kill him. I'm like, I don't want to have fun trying to kill him. It doesn't seem like fun at all. No negative, only positive. Baby, don't worry. I got that test, and I'm all positive. They're like, what? Yeah, no, it's okay. The test came back positive. Which one? Uh, I can't remember. What was it? Hepatitis? Chlamydia? One of those tests you told me to get. That was always my parents. Uh, my parents hated me for lots of reasons, but one of the 
favorite reason, specifically, they knew better than to ask me how I did on any test. Because I was, I would always say, there's a mark, okay, with the jack, I get it, I get it, I'm sorry, I'm sorry I didn't do it. They would always say, how'd you do on the test? And I would say, oh, I did great on the hepatitis test, I got an A. And they're like, get out of the house, get, get out. First, you don't succeed. God fucking damn it. Don't have negative thoughts. Remember your mantra. I'm remembering her. I got a mantra for you. Didn't realize before you can start to run. Yeah, I didn't realize. I didn't remember that for a long time either. Obviously, because I was like, how come I can't make these basic ass jumps? I don't know what's past that dragon. I don't even think it's something I need, and yet I'm compelled to just go that way because I am a dummy. reminders like I, I don't know I just don't I don't play with patience you know you think of speedrunners being reckless but what they're really doing is taking an a, a very acute skill and doing it over and over again without mistakes but they're not being reckless they're being very careful Da -da 
Is he still dead? Who is who still dead? He's still dead? Who's dead? here. I have to get it there. Uh, why? And I think if I remember correctly, which why would I? I think the Joker key is in here. So I have to go in here to get the key to jump to the other place and then the money for the boots and the baby de baby de boo. Don't get me started. appreciate y'all's patience. This is insufferable to me, so I can't even imagine what it's like for you guys to be watching. I love Fax, uh, Fox Xanadu. I call it Fox Xanadu. That's not it. It's Fax uh, Nadu. Sure. I'm going to call it Fox Xanadu because I'm an idiot. I'm an old man. I can make mistakes. It'd be like, sometimes Grandpa just says stuff wrong. Don't tell me how to feel, game. <laughs> 